You know, in this contemporary society of ours, where so many people do so many things and get so much information over the internet, it is important for those of us who have an important message to deliver to our people to utilize the tools of communication in order to reach our people today. The live broadcast of the celebration of the Eucharist is done every day. And what is uh, uh, unique about this is that it is um, present to people not only uh, over the air, uh, but also on the internet. It's and not fair that these people, as they get older and more infirm, are cut off from that source of hope, that source of love, that source of peace, strength, and healing even. So we decided a while ago that we needed to be where our people are, even beyond television, because television and broadcast media only reaches so far. How can we go beyond that, and how can we have a presence for people that goes beyond just between 10 and 10.30, every day of the week. One of the aspects of uh, distribution is uh, being ever present on the internet. Um, so we have used Discover Video uh, for our host to enable that to happen. And uh, they have provided us with an encoder which is set up uh, so that it can take our HD video feed and audio and marry that with uh, some closed captioning and get out to uh, the public via the internet. After, after the Mass is done, my all primary job is to upload the Mass to uh, Discover Video. And I also upload other programs as well, our Crossroads Magazine program and our Mass the Spirit program. But the most important one is the Daily Mass. And uh, it streams live as we are live doing our program. And it also records. So basically after the Mass is over, I go downstairs to one of our other computers and upload to Discover Video and I fill in the metadata, which is the, the title, um, the date of the Mass, what the Mass was celebrating. Well, um, we know that as we continue to utilize the internet to reach out to an audience beyond our broadcast area, that there are many people who have discovered us and day by day more and more people are discovering what we do here in Little Prospect, Connecticut.